all of the Christian message comes from the Bible. So if you can't trust the Bible, you can't trust Christianity. But how can we trust a book that was written over 2,000 years ago and makes such extraordinary claims? I'll give you three quick reasons. Firstly, history. The Bible is rooted in history. Time and again, historians and archaeologists who were otherwise doubtful have found evidence to support what the Bible says. And ancient historians who were writing just after Jesus died confirm lots of what the Bible says too. Most convincingly for me, there are over 5,000 fragments of New Testament manuscripts from within 50 years of Jesus' death. That's way more than we've got for any other ancient book which is accepted as fact. The Bible is historically reliable. Secondly, prophecy. There are about 300 different prophecies about Jesus in the Old Testament. Predictions about his life and what he would do hundreds of years before he did them. And they all come true. Here's just a few of them. One maths professor worked out that the odds of Jesus fulfilling just eight of those 300 prophecies was 1 in 10 to the power of 17. That's this number down here. That's the same chance as you covering the whole UK with pound coins 65 centimetres deep and then trying to find one 50p coin in it, blindfolded. It's mathematically impossible, and to me this proves that the Bible was written by God himself and therefore 100% reliable. Thirdly, Jesus. Jesus said, I am the truth, and I believe him. When I read about what Jesus did, what Jesus said, how Jesus lived, I believe him. If you have doubts about the Bible and its reliability, no amount of historical evidence will persuade you that it's true, even though that evidence exists. Christianity is all about having a relationship with a person, with Jesus, and that is why God has given us this. So if you have doubts, go to Jesus, read this, the Gospel of John in the New Testament, and see if what Jesus says is true for yourself.